Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of The Shadows of Mordor. All right, when we left off, we were dealing with a couple of random disputes around the place because we killed all the war chiefs minus Ratbag, who is technically helping us. And I figured one of the people we should go after is Otha the Red because he's one of the strongest ones and I can't let him get more stronger than he is. So... What we're going to do is hopefully we'll find a mounted beast somewhere around him and deal with him the old-fashioned way. If not, then fuck me. But <laughs> he's currently doing a recruitment for more Uruks, so we're going to take him out there. Hopefully there's a mounted beast. Well, there's a bunch of rabble. Do you want to follow me or do you want to fight? Don't matter none to me. Does that mean we're gonna do both? You pathetic! Oh, oh! Someone's getting a little sassy for the britches there. Okay, I don't see any mounted beasts around here, so this makes this ever so much more difficult. But that's fine with me. Let's take out the bigger threats. There we go. Because I know he's gonna be invulnerable to it. Damn it, I thought I got him. Alright, get one more. There we go. That one's dead. Get that one, and one more. Oh. Never mind. Stop the traitors! Oh, come on now. There we go. There we go. Knock him around a little bit. Yeah, I mean. This isn't what I initially planned, but this works. Really stupid to face me here. Oh well, makes it easier to kill you. Well, I mean, not really. If you really look at it, you know, objectively. Ooh. Okay. Can we get him? Oh, jeez. Come on now. Oh. Oh, he got killed by someone other than me. He got killed by another Uruk. That's not good. Ooh. Recruitment resolved died. Ortha the Red was slain while seeking new followers. Well, that absolutely did not happen. Okay, let's see if we can get this guy. Okay, how about this guy then? Okay, how about this? Uh, we drain him. There we go, for more help shot. And a little bit more. And kaboom. Ow, you little shit. How dare. And there we go. Finish you off. Ooh. The animation got weird there, but I cut off his head, so that had to hurt <laughs> a little bit. Favor of the Lady. Recover 22% health when completing a drain or brand. That actually seems kind of good, but not really. All right. You know, it looks like there's an artifact nearby here, so I'm going to pick that up. But yeah, that did not go the way I expected it would. But then again, I had to improvise because... Well, I mean, we didn't have the mounted beast nearby, so I had to go with the next best weakness, which was combat finishers. But that ended up not working either, because, uh, fuck me. There's the artifact, okay. I was about to say, where the hell is it? What do we got? Lockpick. Yeah, that is really crude. Tied together by two different things. The simple metal prod is a burglar's best friend. The pick is small and easily concealed. It can be palmed or even hidden under the tongue with minimal effort. Don't know why you'd want to hide that under the tongue. That looks like it would hurt. And looks like lockjaw waiting to happen. Jeez. <laughs> In the hands of a skilled thief, the pick can be used to quickly and quietly defeat most locks of non-magical origin. And my controller is vibrating like crazy because I found the memory point, so might as well hit it now. Sir, the situation is very confused. How is it confused? I see the prisoners escaping, running towards the gates, which seem to have blown open by sorcery or sabotage. Archer, stand down! Sir, we're not wasting good arrows on those people. They've served their purpose. They're damned. They're damned well out of my hair. Mordor can take the whole stinking lot of them. And send my compliments to the captain of the gates. I suppose he sent me this lockpick as some sort of joke. Alrighty, well, thank you, Airplane, for being very fucking loud outside my window. But, uh, yeah, seems like, uh, this was orchestrated by 
Someone higher up in the guards? Maybe? Uh, possibly. <laughs> I would think that makes sense. But anyway, that's done. Found a new little artifact. We've got a weapon rune. Do I have that currently on me? Uh, on a head explosion kill. Uh, that doesn't seem as useful as this would. Uh, Drainer Brand, what's this one? Uh, on Nakra, yeah, that was it. On a stealth kill, 15% health, 22% health when completing a Drain or Brand. Drains I do with relative regularity, so I guess I'll do that. And I'll break down the other one, if I can, yeah. That worked. That worked just fine. And I'll keep this one to remind me of Otha the Red and his, you know, somewhat fitting demise. All right. There the we go. The last place we want to be is the one place we are doomed to stay. And the outcast fled into it to escape Gondor. And it is here that the Dark Lord will gather his armies like pieces on a game board. Unless we stop him. Alrighty. Well, that is nice to know at the very least. There was this all the way over here. Really? I could have dealt with that. Oh, man. Hindsight is definitely 2020. Motherfucker. Alright, well. Uh, we got a mission over here from the looks of it. Uh, I assume this is from Smeagol or something of the like. Yeah, the creature Gollum is drawn to the wraith who he calls the Bright Master. Your fate seems bound to his. Alright, I guess we'll find out more about that, I guess. <laughs> because it's the only other thing we have. I beat Otha the Red, and I think he was one of Retbag's bodyguards, if I remember right. Uh, yeah, he was. The other one was uh, Mog the Handsome, which is quite a misnomer. So yeah, we're going to jump up here. There we are. And up we go this way. Oh, we got another artifact over here. That's nice. Get some, get some of these on the way over to dealing with Gollum. What's this? A hoe blade. Oh my. <laughs> what is it? Uh, Numenorians carried a great many things with them in their great diaspora. I think that's how you pronounce that. If I didn't pronounce it right, then, you know, it's because I don't know. But if I managed to pronounce it correctly, Yes. Their journey was long and perilous, and not all who undertook it lived to see their new homes. And they carried with them what they could. Beyond their physical possessions, the tools, and the trinkets, they also carried with them their shared dreams for a better life. Their land was consumed, but they would live on. And the relics are spread throughout Middle-earth. Oh, there it is, right at the tip of the oblade. Oh, He's in jail for a reason. For saying what we're all thinking. You want to live forever? Plow in this field? The elves lord it over us. Don't they just? Sauron's right. We can live without pain, without growing old. And you want to go to war to make that happen? I want the king to listen to good ideas. Well, then, he should have nothing to do with Sauron. Fighting with the elves is not a bad idea. It's the worst idea imagined. Alrighty, then. There's a little bit of backstory for those who know the lore. Me, I, uh, not so much. <laughs> okay, there we go. That's taken care of. Now we head no on towards Gollum. No is in my veins. I am a Northman, an exile. Phallus never let me forget that, and Yorith never cared. To the Eldar, all men are the followers. Fleeting visitors who soon pass beyond the circles of the world. I'm, I'm confused why I was stuck there like that. Okay. But, yeah, that's fair enough, I guess. There we go. Full health recovered, which is kind of what I needed. And... Shattered Memories. Alrighty. Here we go with another main mission, because I need to do more of those. Gods now. Oh, boy. Kicking through bones. Oh, boy. Desecrate one more body and your corpse will join them. Well, all right then. Show me another treasure from your dreams. Yes. We will prove ourselves, Bright Master. We will prove. We 
Alrighty, I guess we don't have a choice here, do we? So, uh, there we go. Oh, great. More rain. Yippee. Oh, he's climbing up that. We can do that far faster than you. Come on now. God, you're an ugly looking shit. <laughs> God damn. Alright. Follow Gollum. Follow us, Bright Master. To the treasures we go. Alright, I guess. Alright, let's pop one of these. Here. No orcs. They spread like poison. Well, yeah. Gimu was slow, but I'm fast. Try to escape like his slaves, and I won't catch you. I will kill you. Okay, that is, uh, that's a way to say it, I guess. I guess we're just gonna stay hidden here for a while, yeah, or? Nobody sends it <laughs> okay, why are you singing? Why are you singing? That is really creepy. Please don't sing. Please don't ever sing. Nasties above. Kills them. Well, I can do that, no problem. Oh shit, I hit the wrong button. There we go. Our old master takes us to the precious. We show him, we show him, and he rewards us. Okay, that is really cool. Okay, and pop, and dead. He likes the bright master, the royal one. Smells sweet. That is really creepy. Um, I'm right here, buddy. He steals from us like bargainses. Bargainses. Okay, it seems like he's just making this shit as he goes along. Which seems a lot like my songs. Then we'll take it. He'll show us, then he steals it. No. No. Okay. We'll Calm it down. We'll take it from him. We'll take it from our sharpest of sharpsies. Um. <laughs> not, not hurting. No hurting. Gentle sharpsies. Uh, these. Shows us bright master. These goes, lyrics are really great. Okay, I guess we got to find the vision artifact. All right. Well, I guess I gotta follow these steps here. Jesus, those song lyrics were the creepiest fucking things. Oh my god. Uh -huh. Your friend seems quick to lead us to danger. Yeah, a little bit. The knowledge of my past is worth any trial. Are you sure about that? Because at this point, I'm starting to wonder. I'm really starting to wonder if maybe sanity is uh, not so high up on the uh, totem pole here. Okay, we gotta go around this way, maybe? Oh, it cuts off in several places. That's gonna be difficult to follow. Alright. I'm just gonna follow it outright because I think it'd be easier that way. Oh, we got something. Got something. What is it, something? What we got? Can we get into the camera frame, please? Oh! It's a circlet of some kind, but. Elven sword. Okay. Mother and daughter. And the husband, I presume. And this guy. Who's this guy? Okay. That's the hammer that we it see the Wraith with a lot. Gift. Wait a second. What a gift. But where is the Okay, he's trying to steal it from us. That is really creepy how he's... Come here! Ow! Okay. Release him. Don't act like you're the fucking... 
condescending terrorist. Dreams. They offer no answers, only more questions. These are not mere dreams. With each vision, my power grows stronger. Okay, these are cool. Alright. Nice to know now. Okay. Okay, ability unlocked. Wraith Flash. Okay. Unleash a powerful flash of light which damages and stuns Uruks or kills ghouls. When your hit streak is charged, press X and A. Oh, great. Another one I need to memorize to use Wraith Flash. Okay, every. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, I need to get my hipster charge for that. There we go. Come on now. Okay, that worked out a little bit better. Okay. Dear gods. These are a lot of them. Good god. Okay. What in the hell are these things even doing here? Dear gods, there's so many of them. Okay, dear God. There's so many I need to kill. How many have I hit already? Like. Fucking 60. No, it's even more than that. It's not counting all of them that I'm killing in one go. There we go. Can this, can this end, please? This is like really creepy. Dear God. What the hell am I supposed to be doing here? There's way too many of them. Well, I mean, he wasn't kidding. They're, this is really dangerous. There we go. Whoo! Fuck. Well, there's a new enemy type. Well, we completed that it. That halfling golem will betray us to the Black Hand the first chance he gets. He has no love for the Dark Lord. That creature has a part to play in the fate of all Middle Earth. I can feel it. Yeah, you're right, but not necessarily in the way you suspect. But, uh... Okay. That's also proof that he used to be a halfling. That is very much proof that he's able to tell him as a halfling. Or he's able to identify him, rather. Okay. Dear Mother of Gods. That was... That was too much. That was a little too much too soon. Holy sh... Note to self, ghouls are really creepy. Please don't ever run into them again. Oh, come on now. There we go. Can we, uh, get some intel from this guy? I think we can. Okay, come on now. Alright, some intel. Oh, I can't kill anyone. Well, I can't get intel on anyone, but I can issue a death threat to... Who can I make a death threat to? Um... Orthog Skull Collector, huh? This guy is barely a threat to me. Uh... Nakro the Immovable, how about you? He's barely a threat. I want to do a death threat to someone who is actually a threat to me. And that does not leave a lot to choose in that regard. He has a fear of ghouls, damage by range attacks, and combat finishers. He might actually be a threat to me. Out of all of these here, that he might actually be a threat. Uh, Volgoom the Drunk. Eh, I don't want to issue a death threat to him. Uh, yeah, pretty much the only one who is an actual threat to me is Humgrat, the cave rat. Umgrat Cave Rat. That is a hell of a name. Alright, let's issue a death threat to him. Death threat set. Power increase. Holy shit. He's protected by a gang. He's got a, uh... He's become invulnerable to stealth and ranged. Okay, fair enough. Uh, Monster Slayer. 
Uh, what was all of it? His power increased, protected by a gang, and greater chance of an epic room. That was what it was. Okay, well. And now he's run. Clear the area so Gollum will emerge. Okay, I guess we'll have to do that then. Do I do I actually have to do that? Okay, I guess then I will have to do that. There we go. Okay, can we sneak up behind this guy and kill him? Yep, I can. There we go. And he's gone. You don't say. But then again, so will the rest of you. Get the headshot on you eventually. There we go. There we go. Can we get one on this guy? Yes. Oh, come on. Okay, get the brain going. Okay, come on. Okay, just get out of my way, buddy. You are. Ooh. That looked like it hurt. Okay. Okay. I keep slamming on the button thinking that it'll do it instantly and then forgetting it doesn't. That's my fault. There we go. And kaboom. Perfect. It keeps saying clear the area so Gollum will emerge, but... A, he's not here. B... Okay, that's weird. That is really weird. Uh... Oh, this is all other stuff, so I'll just leave that alone for now. So, anyway, I'm going to end the episode here for right now because I'm a little bit over time and I'm a little confused as to why I keep saying clear the area so Gollum will emerge when I don't need him to emerge. A and B, he's on the opposite side of the map from the look of it, if uh, that mission is what I think it is. Yeah, over here. Yeah, he's over there. So, I'm going to end the episode here for right now. Probably fast travel over there. Yeah, because there's one of those over there, so I might as well do that. So, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more, and click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in the comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together, and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only, Stray Cat, playing games and killing Utha the Red and following Gollum for a long time for you.